Welcome back to KP's Kingdom, <laughs> cooking with KP, and today I'm going to show you how to make my chicken chili buns. I sounded a little bit kiwi there, didn't I? Anyway, look, this is a really fun recipe, let's get on with it, right, really simple. Here I've got a couple of um, bread buns, and they're about two days old, and they're a little bit on the stale side, they're a little bit dry. Let's get these really nice and juicy. So I'm just going to use a little knife, and I'm going to cut out a nice little hole in the top. Just like that, I'm going to take that little plug out and I'm also going to remove some of the internal bits of bread that we don't really need. We just need a, a nice little shell for my chicken chili buns. <laughs> okay, say that five times quick. Alright, so just remove some of that uh, bread from the inside. I've got a fry pan, a little bit of vegetable oil that goes in. This is a really simple and quick recipe. Two small brown onions, finely diced. They go straight into our fry pan, just like that. Okay, I'm gonna sweat those off. I had a little bit of leftover bacon. Look, let's not waste it. Let's throw that in there, and it's gonna give it a real nice smoky flavor. That can just get cooked off with our onion. Right, really simple. Now, this is a very, very quick recipe to do. All right, so just keep cooking those off. And if you haven't tried making your own chili before, why not? It is that easy. 500 grams worth of chicken mince or ground chicken, depending on where you're from. Put that in. And we're just going to uh, let that brown off and, you know, break that up. We don't want it uh, big chunks. We want a, you know, a little bit of a loose uh, type of mixture. Okay, so just brown that off like I'm doing right there. And in the meantime, I've got a little bit of garlic paste, probably about a good teaspoon maybe two teaspoons worth that's going in mix all of that through just like that okay very very simple now i've already turned my oven on i've got some taco seasoning look i've made this taco seasoning a few times a little bit of uh, oregano and uh if you don't want to make your own taco seasoning look just buy the one in the packet i'm not going to ho hold that against you but uh my one uh does not use as much salt it's a little bit more user friendly all right so we've put our oregano in one 400 gram can of red kidney beans that's going straight in and we've got this sitting at a medium heat 400 grams worth of tomato passata if you're a regular viewer you've seen me do this plenty of times i get a 400 gram can of tomatoes put that in a food processor hit that for 60 seconds and i've got instant passata and i know what is in it give all of that a little bit of a mix through just like that a bit of a stirry stirry and i'm just going to add a little bit of water probably be around about half a cup's worth i'm also going to add in two tablespoons worth of tomato paste concentrate that's just going to give us that real nice oomph and yes i do use a salt reduced tomato paste even though it has more salt than the non no salt okay go figure put a lid on that let that sit for around about 30 to 40 minutes or so all right go and do something else in the meantime all right we're going to come back look at that it's looking really nice leave the lid off for about 10 minutes or so let that reduce a little bit all right really nice and easy all right here we've got our little buns they're all ready for a filling so i'm just going to get a uh, spoon and spoon some of that chicken chili that we just made really quickly into our buns all right not hard to do and the kids will absolutely love eating these is just something a little bit more unique and even feed this to your friends on a uh, for, for lunch or something like that it's just something a little bit different a little bit more fun all right so fill those up with your chili one thing missing and that is cheese put cheese on the top just like i'm doing right there oven sitting 180 degrees and uh once we put all of this cheese on i'm gonna get these little buns and i'm gonna take them away and imprison them into the oven for around about 10 minutes or so or until they end up looking a little bit like that how good does that look love to see you try and make these ones at home i'll try and put a uh, a view of what they look like when you cut them open at the end thank you so much for watching this video really do appreciate it if you like this video or even if you don't like this video hit that subscribe button hit that like button 
Share this video with all your friends. Hit that notifications bell to be notified every time a new video goes up. Hey, look, I'm off to eat my chicken chili buns. And uh, I will catch you next time. All right, bye.